Developing this morning, four barns go up in flames. Coincidence? Fire chiefs in Buncombe County say probably not. We mapped out the spots that were hit, and as you can see, they're not too far apart from each other. The fire chief says the fires are suspicious, and now they're investigating for arson. Fox Carolina's Lindsay Gibbs is live in Buncombe County, and Lindsay, this is just a strange series of events we have going on. Yeah, Shale, we're just outside of Leicester. This is on Turkey Creek Road, and we spoke to neighbors earlier this morning. They say they're shocked to see one of their um, community staples go up in flames. They say this barn um, provided produce to local areas um, surrounding this community, and they say that this is just devastating to see this morning. Now, fire investigators are working to determine if all of these were set on purpose. Yesterday morning, Buncombe County Fire says the first call came in at around 6.30 Wednesday morning, and it just kept going from there. Within the hour, they were called to several locations like this one along Mail on King Road. We went to all of those scenes, and here's what we found when we arrived on Old Newfound Road. The flames still going. After that, we headed to Worley Cove Road. Sad to see nothing but the charred up structure. Then we went to Gilbert and Turkey Creek Road, where we are this morning, as firefighters battled the flames there. And we spoke to people living in the community. They tell us the barn there was built in 1953. One woman we spoke to says she was shocked to see what was left of the barn. Take a listen. A little bit uh, of, of worry and anxiety, but at the same time, you know, I know that I'm watching out for them and they're watching out for me. And, you know, as a community, um, you know, we can get through it. And firefighters say another grassy area was also set on fire on Willow Creek Road. Several barn owners tell us they lost a large amount of hay bales, crucial full livestock in the winter months. And we are told that fire investigators this morning are looking for who may have done this and why they may have done this to the community. And I know many community members are wondering the same thing. But if you do know any information, you are encouraged to call the Buncombe County Sheriff's Department. Max Shale, 